everyone and welcome to this week's Weekly Wrap. Each and every week we're going to be bringing to you the latest in gaming, tech and pop culture. So let's jump right in. This week, Xbox shared the partner showcase presenting fresh trailers, updates and gameplay content by their creative partners. Our highlights from the showcase were Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth, its release date is set for January 26, 2024, and the announcement of Dondoko Island, which looks very, very cool, and you can create and manage the resort of your dreams. Metal Gear fans got a closer look at Snake Eater 3 with the first in-engine game reveal. Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater is currently under development using Unreal Engine 5, and we think it looks pretty incredible from the showcase. Still no release date yet, but we hope to see it sometime in 2024. Last week, we did cover Alan Wake 2 with its release date of October 27th. Now, since it has released, it's come out with new game plus and a great new feature. Remedy Entertainment tweeted shortly after the game became available that not only will you retain weapons and upgrades, but there will be a nightmare difficulty plus an alternative narrative. Exact timings are TBA, but we think it's a pretty great feature. PlayStation have just released a system update for the PlayStation 5. Now, this is only minor in comparison to the big update that recently happened, but let's take a look at what has changed. PSVR 2 players can choose to block the console from displaying their in-game surroundings on the TV or any external display. Personally, I don't think I'd use this feature. And users who listen to music will benefit from the music interface change to allow better selection of music from the control center. Also note that in the US and UK, PlayStation have added a command for voice controls. But sorry Aussies, this feature isn't available to us just yet, but I would actually use that quite a lot. Heads up gamers, next week there's going to be one free game that looks like a hell of a lot of fun. Available for one week from November 2nd is Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. This adorable game sees you play as a chaos-causing turnip that commits tax evasion. Embark on an extraordinary journey to settle your debt with Maya Onion. And this looks so much fun. And our last story today on a personal note is that we have been upgrading or updating our living room and we are currently in the process of reviewing a brand new TCL display, the C845 mini LED. So stay tuned to all of those updates. We'll provide loads of stuff over on Instagram. So be sure to follow me at oneupemily. If you'd like to follow Bo, you can follow him at retro.gamer.guy. The links are in the description of this video. But until next time, I'll talk to you later.